Wow. I love low B tactics, yeah. Oh, I, I was wondering if they took it away. Because I still didn't finish it. Yeah, it looks like it's still up. No, I'm going long. It looks it looks too easy with you. Oh, dude, the outfits are good. They're uh, yeah, they're very nice. It's it's actually making rounds on the internet for like anti anti-woke gaming this year and um, I'm like damn and he's making it big I actually didn't I didn't watch it but um, continue with what he said Hopefully, <clears throat> in in the survey, I, I haven't had that time yet, but I really want to put in the survey what I think about the music. The soundtrack is not good at all. No, but just... Should be streaming on um, my Gecko account, YouTube.
The Chocobo races are all you. I'm more of a beast battleground guy. You know we still got your friends, right? Stick close. Hey, no loitering. No one wants to run up a mill, choke them out. That's weird. How far are you from home? Hello, hello. Can't say I was expecting someone so pretty. Pretty shrewd. Hi, Mister Chocobo Wrangler. Pleasure. Wait, Cloud? Aren't you that kid from the ranch? Oh, 
Hang on. You two know each other? What happened? I hope the stream improved. I put on the headset and mic connected to the controller. Message me if it's better. Before, nothing was attached, which is weird. I don't know how it was picking up the call on the stream. That doesn't make any sense because there's, no, there's nothing connected until now. Unless the actual remote. It's your mic. I could hear the call on stream. Like I was saying, that doesn't make any sense because... I had no mic. It was just me playing the game with nothing attached. But all right. You say it's better, that's, that's good. We were making our way to the saucer for Pico's racing debut when these ones nabbed us. Hold up. How about you tell them the real story? How you were dying out there in the dunes? How we saved your scrawny ass? <sighs> Ungrateful little piece of shit. So, you want me to race Pico? <laughs> the one and only. In that state? Our trek through the desert did a real number on him. Can barely lift a claw. If he doesn't eat and regain his strength, I don't fancy his chances. Good thing his jockey's on the job. Pico needs food, and you're gonna find it. <sighs> Fine. I'm coming too. Okay then. Grab that bird some grub and bring it to me. I'll be waiting. How come we all get to eat veggies? Having trouble finding that feed for Pico? Let me think. <laughs> Maybe check out that underground fighting ring. I bet you'd clean up. Good luck out there, cutie pie. Welcome to Bale Jumper, watering hole for the dregs of the dust bowl. Heard you're in the market for some greens. Maybe. If so, I've got a garden up on the cliff. Everything's yours for the taking. Assuming there's anything to take, I've intended to it in ages. Here, go see for yourself. Be sure to keep an eye out for fiends, though. Place is crawling with them. That was easy. He looks promising. Let's go somewhere more quiet. <laughs> I ain't gonna hurt ya, promise. <laughs> oh, come on. I don't bite. Oh, am I holding you up? You lost or something? What, got a problem? Oh, am I holding you up? Over there. Uh huh. Keep going. <laughs> Not far now. Hmm. You gotta kind of fight a fight a guy with the sword. And here we are. <laughs> now we can have a nice private talk without anyone butting in. <laughs> <laughs> It's time you got a lesson in the way things work around here. Don't worry, you can thank us later. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> 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 
You were out of our league. I mean, uh, thanks for the match. It was a real learning experience. Wasn't it, boys? <laughs> oh, great. We got something special for you. A gift to remember us by. Here. And with that, we'll hurry up and get out of your hair. Right, boys? Yeah. <laughs> Very sorry to have troubled you, but we won't do it again. Promise! Oh man, the Japanese mannerisms are too strong. Maybe a Japanese thug would do that. <laughs> Something. I suppose the produce here ain't all bad. I mean, compared to the stuff folks are growing out in the grasslands, it's But hey. <sighs> Wish they'd hurry up and move on already. Oh, hell no. They're so far out of up there. <gasps> Bro, come back. Dude, he's screaming like crazy. Yeah. 
Hector's crazy. I'm scared right now. You know how you were scared at the, uh... Oh, I can hear that guy. Hey, come back here. Wait a minute. Two mega potions. I'm gonna need it for this guy. Dude, what do you You're just making me fight all these crazy bees. Back here before. Oh. I just want to punch you. Hey. Oh. You're lucky I found this. All these goodies. I feel like the game barely started getting good. Found the golden saucer. Where are you? Here's the point. I don't see it. Oh no. Do you see that Rin? many they're going a thousand needle me Figures it would end with Cactar. Uh, mother actors. I knew this was gonna happen. I would honestly rather fight a a raid boss or what are they called summon. These little guys give me the heebie jeebies.
just checking if you're watching. I did not know that they made such creepy noises. They were really creepy to leave some music. They hit me with something. Why are they poisoning me? Thousand per hand. <laughs> this ends here. So much for being a mercenary. How to not get wrecked by Cactar. Ah, this time. This time for sure. It's any better for him than a standard brush down. Pico's been feeling peckish. Is that the same voice actor as Aerith? She sounds the same. But nowhere near enough. Yeah, he's looking a lot better now. But we could get him in great shape with a touch more. From where, though? Where else do they have plants? I didn't see anything else. Don't you dare go disappointing my man, Gus. You, right? Trouble finding that feed for Pico? 
Let me think. Hmm. I did see one of those scam artist lecturers buying veggies the other day. Good luck out there, cutie pie. Lecturers? How come y'all get to eat veggies? Artist lecturers. Listen up, asshole! Got those greens you were after? Well, good. Guess my hands-off farming method works better than I thought. Yep, I did. <sighs> you seem like a... That's our house specialty. Call it sunshine. We take moonshine and water it down so the flavor's just still perceptible. That does not look like something. and welcome to my swindling seminar. Today, for the very first time, I'll be unveiling the art behind the con, teaching you the tricks of my trade. Gone are the days of getting duped. Remove the wool over your eyes, and instead, join me in the fleecing. You, sir, have excellent timing. I'm conducting a seminar and would appreciate your help. And, as thanks for your assistance, rest assured you will be handsomely rewarded. All you need to do is speak with my lovely pupils here. Four of these folks are lying while one and only one is telling the truth. Your job is to find the odd one out. Ah, there's also a small fee to participate, but I'm sure you won't mind. Swindler's challenge. Holding a seminar and stealing five aspiring swindlers with the tricks of this deceitful trade, your mission is to discern which one of the disciples is telling the truth. Each guest will cost 500 gil, no refunds, to choose wisely. By visiting notable locations around the dust bowl, review your notes and examine. I think a closer look. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna be drinking good tonight. If you're looking for a place to get loaded, then look no further than Bail Jumper. It's the only bar that serves Cosmo Canyons. You've been to the weapon shop? It's ridiculously loud in there. I like it though. Helps me relax. Plus they sell potions there too. All right, I'm gonna check them one at a time. If you're looking for a place to get loaded, then look no further than Bail Jumper. It's the only bar that serves Cosmo Canyons.
There's something. Well, hello. Good to see you again. How about... Some thugs literally ran me out of town. Made for great action shots. Hopefully folks can feel their grittiness. I've already got solid pictures of the prison, so let me know if you find any other good backdrops. What is this? Out of the way! Listen up, assholes! What's your manager in my dimension? Here to wet your whistle. I can fix you a drink if you like. Just don't go complaining that it tastes weak. It's delicate. Okay, can I see what you sell? Don't know why I bother. This stuff's more water than booze. Here to wet your whistle. Just don't go complaining that it tastes weak. It's delicate. What's your menu? Don't know why I bother. This stuff's more water than booze. Here to wet your whistle. I can fix you a drink if you like. Just don't go complaining that it tastes weak. It's delicate. You're hitting that stuff pretty hard. Good thing it ain't too strong. It may be diluted, but it's got a refined taste. You're hitting that stuff pretty hard. Good thing it ain't too strong. Don't know why I bother. This stuff's more water than booze. If you're looking to get stronger, my store has everything you'll need. What do you think of my store? Be honest. It's the best you've ever seen, right? Quiet as solitary, guaranteed. Considerably dangerous location, so I decided to disguise myself. How did I do? Costumes like these are known to elicit a calming effect, so I should be safe. Unfortunately, we can't say the same for Bear. I'm confident of his innocence, though, and I will do everything in my power to help prove it. Okay, hey, that's the desert. That means that the Tomberry King's on the, the other end of the desert. If there's anything else I can do for you, please let me know. I'm always happy to help. Alright, am 
I need an Otacon because this looks like it's going to be annoying. I'm dying to read Gus's autobiography, Meditations on the Outlaw Life, but the bookstore still doesn't have it in stock. You checked out the graffiti at Gus's place? He's got a Del Sol cactuar in there. See if you can find it. If you visit the Beast Battleground, you might just run into a rare monster named Test Zero. <laughs> You checked out the graffiti at Gus's place? He's got a Del Sol cactuar in there. See if you can find it. <laughs> I'm dying to read Gus's autobiography, Meditations on the Outlaw Life, but the bookstore still doesn't have it in stock. I'm dying to read Gus's autobiography, Meditations on the Outlaw Life, but the bookstore still doesn't have it in stock. You've been to the weapon shop? It's ridiculously loud in there. I like it though, helps me relax. Plus they sell potions there too. for a place to get loaded, then look no further than Bail Jumper. It's the only bar that serves Cosmo Canyons. <laughs> I'm gonna be drinking good tonight. They don't sell Cosmo Canyons. Be they careful not to lose it all. Like this place ain't for amateurs, so unless you want to see me away, Welcome to society. It was nothing. I may have busted a rib, but I made it back in one piece. Got a lot of Kirk blood? Then you come to the right place. All our most corrupted beasts are camping in the pit. In the ring. Welcome to Beast Battleground. 
So, you looking for a thrill you won't find anywhere? Defeat a few fiends and there could be some fresh new greens in it for oh, you. Oh, I don't even need to do that for story. Thank God. I think the first guy's wrong. They said Moonlight. <laughs> No time to celebrate. Field of the field of something. All done. What the fuck? Still taking poison damage or anything? Let's <laughs> go. 
Just like that, okay? Look at you. Be sure to check out some of our other contests, too, if you're in the market for a little danger. Nothing suits the soul. It's my dream. Monsters. And that if makes three. Once Pete goes out of school, he'll be ready to hit the track. And you will move something on good. Because he's thinking of my enemy. Get it for a fight. That's it.